streak. Some of these humans have pulled their heads out. My sis wouldn't be living here if there wasn't some humanity left in humans. Your sister lives on Earth? Actually, Veladi, about a million Vu live here on Earth right now. Of course, the humans don't know that. If I touch you, you can see them. Look, there's a couple of Vu right there. This town is one of their colonies. They like to stay together. Holy crows for toast. This is mind-boggling. We're almost at my sister's place. Why don't you come and meet her? I wondered if that could be. I guess I should change. Tara! Oh, oh. Rex, you haven't changed a bit! Oh my gosh, it's been a long time. How's it, a little yes, brother? Yes, it has. Hey, I'd like to introduce you to an old friend of mine who will also oh, be As I live and breathe, Bobby G. Well, it has been a while, hasn't it? Hey, seen any elves lately? Carol? Your strict sister? Well, I guess that explains a whole hell of a lot. You two know each other? What's that about? It's an embarrassing episode of my life, Strick. I'd really rather not talk about it. I'll tell you another time, Strick. Uh, now, now, come on, come on inside, you two. <laughs> Have you heard from our brother Strack? I mean, I worry about our little brother I haven't seen forever. Uh, he is doing pretty much what he wants. He knows what he's doing. He can't fix it. Mom getting along these days. Oh my gosh, ever since she made that film, you know that film, oh, she's decided it would be a good idea if she would age gracefully, uh, you know, just so she doesn't like throw the limelight onto herself uh, unwarranted. Oh, I'm just telling you what, I cannot believe what that woman's gonna do next. I told her she should stay out of the public limelight, but oh, no, 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 no. Oh, you know what mom's like, she is crazy. I think it runs in the family. What? What do you mean? Um, I think I have to go water some plants. Relax, Bobby G. Boys, would you like some more tea? You best say yes, Valadi. Uh, yes, please. Strick, you seem to bring out the crazy side in your sister. She wasn't like this when I was hanging out with her. Well, you know, man. Family drama. It seems to be a universal condition. is tiring me out. Oh. oh, we are safe from public view here, though. Oh, little brother. You look so cute in your natural form. Knock it off, Kara. So, do you have anything for me? I was wondering when you'd ask. Check this out. Ooh, that's a real hot circle, Cal. Can I listen to it? Major score, Cal. Excellent. It rained, it poured. I'll pay top dollar for that. Alright! That should last me all the way through the winter. Hey, 
I don't get it. You guys seem to really revere this old stuff. Me, I prefer hip-hop or rock. You've got it all wrong, Bobby G. You see, whenever a race develops the technology humans have just started to achieve, their music tends to all sound the same as all the other planets. It is the early acoustic stuff that really shows the true human condition. All this modern music is created by the corporate crime syndicate's need to dominate and profit. Everything they produce is stripped of any true expression. This is how most of the Vu on Earth survive. They collect and export old recordings. One record will support my sister for several years, but it has to be the right one. Some collectors like classical, but it is old folk that gets the top dollar. In fact, some races out there have wanted to invade Earth for some time, but it is the demand for humans' indigenous recordings that have kept Earth protected for a while now. Oh, look at the time. Well, boys, I've got some bills to pay, so sorry to kick you out, but the jewelers do close in an hour. Well, uh, do come back and visit again sometime, little brother. Uh, you know, next time you're in the neighborhood. Oh, and don't be a stranger, Bobby G. Come and visit any time. Huh? Boy, Strick, your sister's pretty weird. Do you know how strange that sounds coming from a talking gorilla? You sure I can't come with you? You know the answer to that, old friend. Just keep the faith, Veladi Tudasari. Your day will come, I have no doubt. Up a trunk. Now what would you do when your baby packing up?